Now we're going to add an in-between note, like we did, and a pinch. So if we look at this second line in our tab, we have the E chord in-between note, and then a pinch on the second string. Do that again. One and two. Between note and then a pinch on another string. And of course, if we carry that over to the A7, it's going to sound pretty much very similar there. B7, same as the A7. Now, this in-between note and pinch, that's the basis, the basic part of what this Piedmont picking or Travis picking is all about. So, uh, in our next segment, we're going to put a couple of, just a couple of in-between notes. That's all we're going to do in the next segment.